Hi, my name is Julia Gauklitz, and I'm a postdoctoral scholar in Peter Dorstein's lab at UCSD. I'm really interested in understanding what the array of small molecules are that are contained in foods and how that impacts our health. For example, there are many different natural toxins which can be found in foods. Some of them are known to be present, such as Roquefortine C that's found in blue cheeses. However, others may be more unexpected or, they should be, or they're found in places where we don't really expect or want them to be. And so if we take rock for C as an example, we want to know what types of foods it's found in. And we can use MAST to query this across not only a broad array of foods, but many different data sets as well. In the actual MAST search, we found that rock for C was identified across a number of different data sets. This included the Global Foodomics food data set, as well as fungal cultures, for example, penicillium. When we drill down a little deeper into the food data set, we see that it's found in blue cheese samples. Now this would be expected based on our literature searches as well. So we're able to take a compound of interest and understand both where it's found and be able to make an inference about the types of, in this case, microorganisms that are producing it. When we move forward, we could do this with many different types of molecules and draw conclusions about their biological sources.